Kia ora and welcome to this IT training tutorial video on modifying the normal style. As discussed in the introduction to styles, normal is the basic text and paragraph formatting of your document. Normal will be the style used in your thesis body paragraphs. You'll apply and modify the heading styles to use as your chapter heading levels, and you may apply other built-in styles like the quote style, for example, and modify those as necessary. Rather than spending time reformatting every basic body paragraph to look the way you want, you simply modify normal instead, and this is very easy. To modify normal, go to the gallery on the Home tab and either right-click over that icon and choose Modify, or you can go in the Styles group and in the bottom right corner, choose the little box to open the Styles window. If you don't see a preview, you may not have a tick here, you may want to just tick that so that you can see all the styles listed there. This is not the full set of styles, but it'll be the ones that are recommended for your use right now. So in this list, if you went to normal, you'd hover until you see this arrow to the right, and then when you just do a normal left click, you can bring that up and choose modify. We're only going to change font and paragraph settings for our styles. For the changes you want to make, you can use this little central area here, or you can go to the format button to find further changes. I'll go in here and open the font window. Now, if I want to, I could change the font face, and I might change that to something like Times New Roman, and I may even change the size of it, but anything between 10 to 12 points is normal. You don't have to change to Times New Roman unless you've been told to by your supervisor. Leaving it on Calibri is perfectly fine most of the time, but some departments do prefer the formality of Times New Roman. So I'll click OK when I've done that. For the paragraph spacing, I'll go back into the Format button and open the Paragraph window. Most people will leave the alignment set to left, but if you've been told to change it to Justified, then go ahead and choose it from here. And then down in this bottom section, your line spacing inside of your paragraphs should be set to one and a half lines or double, which is two lines, and that will spread out your paragraph inside of your document. Now you also absolutely need to put some space after your paragraph so you create more white space in the document. The recommendation is that if you've used one and a half lines, you probably want to change this to 18. If you've used double or two lines, you probably want to change this to something like 24. So set those to what you like, but make sure you allow your paragraphs plenty of white space around them. I'll click OK and OK again. And you see how having that space automatically inside of my settings means I don't have to do this all the way through over 100 pages of thesis trying to create extra space. All your changes should now be visible in every normal paragraph in the document, which so far right here is the entire document. We'll come back in and change those headings in a moment. But that's all for this video on modifying the normal style in Word. I hope you found it useful. Thanks for your attention. Kia ora.